Blessings. My name is Svetlana. I am a divine healer and a spiritual life coach. My journey started over 10 years ago after a tragic death of my husband. I remember it happened so suddenly. I was lost, I was young, and I was left with a one-year-old, beautiful, beautiful boy. I recognized at that moment that it would be unfair for him to lose mother and father at the same time, even though I was in pain and I was escaping and I was hurting so deeply. I wanted to find a way out of the darkness and brokenness, find my way back to light. At that time, my home was a space of phenomena. I didn't understand what was going on. Things were moving around, the light bulbs would just go off. I started looking for answers to the question, what happens after death? And I looked. I looked in religions. I would be going to the church. I would be going to the Buddhist temple, meditating with monks. I was having a conversation with the rabbis and looking everywhere else I could possibly look to find the answer to my question. Where did he go? What happened to him? I really, really needed to know. I so wanted to know. The phenomena around me and the dream that I was experiencing, everything was moving me to search. That quest took me onto the deepest spiritual journey of my life. I had no idea that today I would be doing what I'm doing now, helping people to overcome their pains, brokenness and struggles, and finding their light. And as the time progressed, and I found so many different answers, and I found the peace within, not only I was able to connect with him, and speak with him from the other side. Have the depths of conversation for over seven years that pushed me and pulled me into the realms that are beyond our human mind and beyond our human awareness. And so today, I am helping people to overcome grief, to recognize that death is not the end but just in a transition. We are never born and never die. Energy that always moving and flowing, whether we are in a physical form or not. Everything in our life has a deeper meaning. Everything that happens to us, for us, has a deeper meaning for our soul's evolution, for our soul's calling, so that we can rise up, so that we can learn, so we can understand and shine with our light the way for others, so they can heal too. I connected with Svetlana, first of all, through her energy healing, which I was very impressed and very impressed to learn more about. But as I got to know about her story, I was really impressed with her story and just how she has overcome so much, healed so much, and now she's healing other people. And it's so beautiful because as people go through these traumatic situations and then they're able to overcome, they transform and they can then turn around and help other people. And to me, that is so inspiring. I love connecting with people that share their stories and inspire other women. So definitely stay tuned. I want to show you other stories of inspiring women that have overcome their trauma and have transformed. Also, if you have a story of transformation through trauma, I would love to, to showcase that through visuals. So definitely reach out and let me know and then stay tuned for more in the series.